Today, we're talking about driving decarbonization, extending Anthos, Next 2022, and the Google Government Summit. I'm Anu, and welcome to This Week in Cloud, where we serve you the lowest latency news. When Google set out to achieve 24-7 carbon-free energy in our operations by 2030, we committed to share insights and lessons that could help others move in the same direction. This week, we released a white paper that details our experience with a new energy transaction model that we call a carbon-free energy manager. We hope the insights in this white paper will support organizations move to source round-the-clock clean power. We are pleased to announce the general availability of virtual machine support in Anthos. VM support is available on Anthos for bare metal, now known as Google Distributed Cloud Virtual. Customers can now run VMs alongside containers in a single unified Google Cloud connected platform in their data center or at the edge. Registration is now open for the Google Government Summit taking place on Tuesday, November 15th, 2022. We're excited to welcome the government community in person for a full day of networking, best practices, and learning from peers to help accelerate the mission of government. Register now to join us for the full day event. Can't join us in person? Register so you can catch the opening keynote via live stream or on demand at a time that works for you. Google Cloud Next is just around the corner on October 11th through the 13th. Join us live online along with 1 million builders, dreamers, and leaders for Google Cloud Next 2022, where we'll learn and grow together to meet tomorrow head on. Register now for online programming and the opportunity to attend in-person events. All registration is complimentary. If you want to read more about these announcements or see a full list, check out the link. Any thoughts or ideas? Leave us a comment or tweet at us. We'll see you in the cloud.